Here next to my New Year's Eve in Asia. And ladies and gentlemen, they did this despite the fact that simultaneously the redevelopment of IPC's shopping center was taking place. With that in mind, ladies and gentlemen, allow me to officially welcome all of you here today to meet your friends. Give yourselves a big round of applause. Thank you for joining us. To all our partners, our tenants, esteemed guests, ladies and gentlemen, a very, very warm welcome to all of you here today. And on behalf of IPC Shopping Centre, we want to say a big, big thank you to all of you joining us here to celebrate this wonderful milestone. And with that in mind, allow me to also take this opportunity to wish you all a very happy 2018. Woohoo! Give yourselves a big cheer, ladies and gentlemen. It's a little bit early, but happy new year, ladies and gentlemen. And what a way to kick off, even the weather is aligned. So ladies and gentlemen, this morning, we have a fantastic event planned for all of you. But first and foremost, I want to ask you guys, and please put your hand up if you agree with me, okay? If you are just joining us here at IPC Shopping Center for the first time over this past year, when you stepped into the shopping center, did you immediately feel at ease? Put your hands up. Right? It's not just me. And you know, my theory is this. It's because of the beautiful pastel colors that just emanate and give you this soothing feeling. As far as first impressions go, I am in heaven. And on top of that, if you look around, you'll notice a lot of really, really wonderful touches. We've got these Swedish elements, most notably in the wooden touches. And one of my all-time favorite things, now, I don't know about you, but as a little girl growing up, I always wanted to have a horse. And guess what, ladies and gentlemen, IPC Shopping Center has Dala horses everywhere. So take a look around you, you'll notice one beautiful one standing right here. And I'm gonna share a little bit about the symbolicness of this. Now it's actually, they actually play a very, very important and significant role in Sweden. And they represent a man's best friend. They're reliable, they're hard workers, and these are just some of the values that IPC stands for. Now ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure Karen, our spokesperson, will be sharing more about that later on. But for now, to bring you back to the present, how many of you, or who can tell me what year IPC first opened its doors? Any guesses? Wait, are you part of the team? Okay, okay, yeah. <laughs> Any guesses, ladies and gentlemen? I'll give you a hint. It was in the early 2000s. Big round of applause. One of the best ads I've seen in a long, long time. The most viral video, without a doubt, for any shopping center of all time in Malaysia. So big cheer once again, ladies and gentlemen. Woohoo! So ladies and gentlemen, it's time to officially get this morning started. I would like to invite you all to join me and give a thunderous warm welcome for none other than Miss Corinne Lim, ladies and gentlemen, the general manager of IBC Shopping Center, to join us up here on stage and deliver her opening remarks. Over to you, Karen. Mr. Joachim Hoxender, the center manager of My Town Shopping Center. Thank you guys for coming and joining us today. Of course, um, members of the media, our value tenants, my fellow co workers, invited guests, and ladies and gentlemen. As many of you know, IPC Shopping Center has recently undergone a major redevelopment as we upgrade our center and develop to the changing needs of our surrounding communities and shoppers' lifestyle while staying true to our Swedish heritage. It was an extremely fast-track construction over a timeline of less than 10 months without any interruptions to our center. And my massive thanks to Mr. Matthew Buford, our project manager from the expansion team of IKEA Southeast Asia. Thank you, Matt and leading an excellent construction team. You have contributed enormous effort in making IPC redevelopment such a great success. Thanks again, man. Our redevelopment, we are taking another big step in sustainability by working towards green building standard 
and the Gold Certification of Leadership in Energy and Environmental Design. Our solar panels will be contributing a minimum of 3% energy saving annually, while our rainwater harvest plant will be supplying 100% to our landscape irrigation demand, just to name a few. Our renewal and improved recycling in the buyback centre is also now relocated to a more strategic location at the P1 car park. We have an air-conditioned reception area to welcome all the green makers and we are offering a humble buyback on all recyclable materials that is sent to us. We hope the tenants will be working a lot more closely with us in contributing to the sustainability operations. In addition to the redevelopment, IPC also introduced a new brand logo to mark our 15th anniversary this year. The new logo, as you can see, has a unique color combination of blue and pink to showcase the sense of personality of creating positive connections. Our goal is to continue positively and touch the life of everyone who visits our center. We hope that through our redefined retail offering, improved services, and enhanced integration with IKEA and the Curve, shoppers will have a fantastic shopping experience not only in IPC, but also in the shopping destination of MDCC. We also hope to bring family, friends and people closer by connecting and inspiring hearts. Lastly, we hope that IPC can be comfortable and preferred shopping local community shopping centre of your choice. So today, as we celebrate this milestone, I would like to take this opportunity to thank all our tenants for joining us and spread this joy and create a wonderful shopping moment for all who walk in. And for all of you present today, may you have a memorable and joyous experience exploring IPC Shopping Centre. In conjunction with the upcoming Chinese New Year, I wish everyone a prosperous year ahead with many fruitful and happy returns. Go ahead, Fat Choi. Thank you. Thank you to the rebranding, and we can't wait to share more with you. For now, ladies and gentlemen, please join me and let us welcome Mr. Thomas Lambert, who is the Shopping Centre's Director for IKEA Southeast Asia, to join us on stage. Dear all, thank you very much to join us on this big day. I am very confident to say that we have secured the success of IBC for many years ahead with this redevelopment. And yes, we have invested a lot of money, blood, sweat and tears. And uh, we also experience that uh, it's very difficult to run a shopping center during this big redevelopment. And it's really difficult to do redevelopment in an open center. But we did it. Shopping center team should mention three of our big tenants. Ace Hardware, Spotlight and Harry Norman. They were trading during the whole redevelopment. What an achievement and what a commitment to our customers. Great job. We as a developer and operator, we have invested a lot to get the best customer journey. And we are now very happy with the look and feel and the functionality. But we all know that the most important uh, part in any shopping center is the tenants. And I will not be able to mention all of you now because I didn't get that time. So I apologize that I will just mention a few. We have two anchor flagship stores in IPC, Harvey Norman and uh, popular bookstores. And they have a, the new format already proven to be a success. But of course, they know since years the benefits to be in a shopping center anchored by IKEA. Pardini and uh, Brown's Outlet. Have you seen the new stores? They know that retail is about details and what a fantastic job they have done. We have also get new retailers joining as H&M, Cotton On and uh, NCY Kiki. So now IPC Shopping Center is a really strong in fashion. You know we have a new supermarket, Ben's Independent Grocer. That is a supermarket that takes customer experience to the highest level. 
I can recommend to the taps beer bar. And then, of course, food. All is about food in uh, Malaysia. And uh, we have increased the number of cafes and restaurants with more than 20 outlets. So now we have a food offer on each floor, including Alfresco with a brand new Akia Cafe. Thank you for that. And of course, Foodland in P1. So now we have an offer for the quick bite, lunches, family dinner, and a romantic date. And we have done this all together. Together we are creating a meeting place. And with IKEA and the Curve, we are a really strong destination for shopping, food, and leisure. Thank you all to have done uh, this accomplishment. Thank you. Thank you so much, Thomas. I mean, I would like to invite you to join us over here for our big smiling for our photographers. Perhaps we can direct you to the middle now. Straight ahead, yeah. And one more. Over here for our media friends on the right-hand side. Keep looking over here. There we go, beautiful. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it is time. So we're gonna do this on the count of three. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to invite you all to join us in the countdown. Can I hear you? Ladies and gentlemen, in three, two, one, take it away. Woo! Thank <laughs> you. 